Henry and Melville went into Bushfield's office to get the paper signed up on the mortgage loan on June 24, 1932. Melville was at Chas Campbell's doing work for three and a half days and scraping two. He got $14. Henry paid $70 to William McNichol on August 5th, August 1932, on interest Jane and Anne owed. Melville split wood all day Friday, and then there was Monday afternoon. $4. got a piece of the cream separator mended at Fred Hollenbeck. He got it paid for on July 13th, oh. $10 still owing on July's account. Jane and Anne's mortgage on our old home closed February 1st, 1933. Mr. Abister closed it. Adeline Mathers was the accounts keeper for her family in Huron County, Ontario. In her diary, she records that the Mathers had lost their second mortgage due to the economic impacts of the Great Depression, which severely affected Canada's rural communities. 